Hey guys, I'm Shane from Jags Journeys. If you love theme parks, attractions, events, and more, anything fun, you've landed on the right channel. Make sure you hit the subscribe button right now and come on with me and join the next journey. Hey guys, Shane from Jags Journeys. I'm back today at Dreamworld in the Gold Coast. Uh, this is my first visit back since the park has reopened after the Queensland eight day lockdown. Uh, we're here today to give you a steel tie pan construction update. Uh, they have been working through by the look of things, so there definitely has been some more progress on the steel tie pan construction. Uh, so we wanna give you an update today. So let's go inside now and check it out. So why don't you come along with me and join the journey. park there's actually a lot of people here today so I'm guessing everyone's missed coming to the theme parks and uh, yeah, it seems pretty busy like first up this morning had to wait in quite a big queue out the front anyway let's go and check out some of the steel tie paint construction walking down toward toward the buzzsaw area but the the fence has actually been or well, more of the fence has been removed since last time we were here so you can actually see more of the steel tie pan now compared to before which is great And since last time we're here, you, as you can see now, they've actually got a lot more of the theming getting started. So in between the pathway, there's some soil that's gone down, stones, there's some large boulders for the theming all through this part here. And you can also see some more of the fake rock work or tunnels uh, through the center there. We'll go around the other side and have a better look at that. But yeah, there's actually been a lot of progress Definitely a lot of progress since we were here last. And it is Saturday and they're still working on a Saturday to get it done. And also the fencing has gone up for the queuing areas or where you walk up to uh, get onto the ride. So uh, all those, all those uh, barriers or fencing that's definitely all gone up since the last time we were here as well. So you can see where they've started to put the path in to hit up the side of the steel tie pan. So we'll just head up the other end and have a closer look at where that joins up. So definitely more rock work has been completed and even the painting of the rock work has 
commenced on this side of the tunnel. So I started making the new pathway from like the train station over there through here to the current steps near the steel type end. Because obviously the, the current pathway is just a temporary pathway so once they put the finish the new pathway there um, obviously the train track is supposed to go through this way here so it'd be interesting to see uh, which direction those tracks take because it looks a, a little bit steep through here um, so that will be interesting to see how that pans out. Lots more progress definitely. Awesome to see so much uh, groundwork, landscaping going ahead. Fantastic. I guess we're only about three months away now from opening, or maybe three to four months. So I just bumped into Adrian from AU underscore theme park fan on Instagram here at Dreamworld. He's just ridden the buzzsaw again. Let's see what he thinks about his current ride on the buzzsaw. I think that was better than the last one. Yeah? Yeah, it was good. Harness was tighter. Oh. Bit bruising probably, but that's all right. <laughs> really? I'd rather it be tight than loose. Well, that's for sure. Uh, it was, yeah, way better than the last one. Must be getting used to it. Absolutely. So this is the the first time you've ridden it since the last yeah. time we featured you on uh, riding it twice. Yep. So you're going to do it again? No. <laughs> One at a time. One at a time now? Yes. All right. Fair enough. You're still braver than me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, not for me, mate. I've, nah, I'll pass. So just down near the corroboree area uh, at the back of the old uh, log ride area is a new area of construction here we're just trying to figure out what it is for we can't work it out um, there's a there's a it comes in from the pathway here and basically just circles around and there is a looks like electrical and water there as well so watch this space there is obviously something going to be uh, put in this area um, don't know what though and um, yeah, it'd be interesting. We will keep you updated each time we come back to the park. Looks like definitely there's going to be an entry point here. So I would say it's going to be some kind of sign above here. But uh, they haven't cut a place for the fence yet. Hey guys, so if you know what's happening as far as that little construction area near the old log ride that we just showed you uh, let us know in the comments below if you have any ideas on what that little area that little pathway could be so let us know in the comments below Well, hey guys, that's going to do it from our look at the Steel Taipan construction update here at Dreamworld. So it's great to see a lot more progress on the theming side of things and the rock work. Uh, so yeah, things are coming along really well and uh, hopefully we'll pop back in a couple of weeks time and we'll see a lot more and we'll update you when we do that as well. 
Anyway, guys, uh, that's all I've got time for today. So uh, if you're new to our channel, Jags Journeys, please make sure you hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell, keeps you up to date with all the fun journeys we have. Also, don't forget to like and share our videos. That'd be greatly appreciated. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next journey.